Smiles, the sexy smiles. Okay, ready? One, two. <laughs> You're doing so good. I'm literally like a hot dog. <laughs> and I'm a hamburger. Now let's go. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Sonali. If you guys don't already know me, and this is my roommate Laura. If you don't already know her, then <laughs> go check out my vlogs. Duh. Um, but yeah, we are gonna do a get ready with me today because. I had to get ready and she was just like, we should do it together and I was just like, you know what, we should. So we did. <laughs> so if you want to see how to get two looks in one video, Ooh. oh my god, you got that two for then, one special. Yes. <laughs> then stay tuned. Mute your phones first step of a beauty tutorial. Wow. So much work. So first off, I'm going to start with this eye rescue protein booster from Pro Series, um, from Jack Black. I don't even know where I got this. I'm pretty sure I stole it from home, so like, <laughs> I don't know whose this was, but it's nice and I like the feeling of it. But I always wanna be like super moisturized. I just take this Mario Badescu. I just use that. Oh really? Yeah. Yeah, I just, yeah, I moisturize before this, so. I've been trying to start my makeup, like my eyes first. Really? That's yeah. good. But then like sometimes like it's so annoying to have to put on foundation because then you have to like go around yeah. it and it's like no, it's hard to be like you you can't be messy with it. Yeah. I'm going straight for the brows, girl. Okay, so next I'm using the Smashbox Photo Finish Foundation Primer. This is a core minimizing one and it's like the purple one. And I just used this literally yesterday. And like I feel like I sound so stupid when I say this, but I thought it was gonna come out purple. Oh, it's like I just beige. Too. Like, cause I thought it was like, each color was like yeah. their color. Like I yeah. thought there was like a green primer and like a purple mm -hmm. one. So like, I don't know, I felt really dumb when I was like, uh, beige, what? This is really hard. <laughs> Especially cause you're balancing your big mirror on your one no, knee. No, seriously though. Comment down below who you think is gonna be faster and who you think is gonna be done. It's gonna be me. I don't know. You're really good at like getting your makeup done really quickly though. Yeah, I think I'm gonna try it really hard. <laughs> oh really? So this is a competition now? It might be. So I'm using the NYX eyebrow pencil. But I want to buy the pump, but I also think I'm gonna be like over my foundation for a while because I always come back to it. Yeah. But like, I don't know. I feel like I'm gonna be over it by the time I like actually buy the pump. I don't know, I'm just like really obsessed with my Makeup Forever HD stick and I'm running out. Like it's on like the last like screw up. <laughs> so I have to get more, but it's very expensive. So I'm just trying to wait as long Is there a ball in there? No, I'm just like shaking it. Oh. Like, put it down. I also wanna wait to get a new foundation for like my summer color. No blend challenge. Hey, what if we did? <laughs> You're scary! I know! <gasps> I look like white chicks or something. You Don't do? I? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, now I'm going blend. Are you going for full glam today? Or are you going for natural chic? I don't know. I have like a lot of meetings today. It also has to be like pretty. Mm -hmm. But not too pretty. I used to wear winged eyeliner to the school every day. Mine were like crazy. I wanted to be <laughs> hipster so bad. And that and was so hipster back in the day? It was. Before it was like a beauty trend, it was like that crazy cat eye that like oh. Amy Winehouse had. Okay. Trying to make me go to rehab. But I say no, no, no. It's so funny compared to like <sighs> me though, because like yeah. you're starting with your foundation and I'm like looking at your like. Okay. What if we like didn't do like contour and stuff? Like I would just go out like this. You look like a potato. <laughs> I really do. <laughs> Have you ever filmed a whole video and then realized you had a booger in your nose? Um, no, <laughs> but I think one time, like more than half the video, I had lipstick on my teeth. Oh. And I was like, are you kidding me? When I was in 12th grade and I wanted to be a YouTuber. Oh yeah. No. Lara this... was a YouTuber before me, by the way. <laughs> she was the no. trendy one. No, I wasn't. <laughs> it was so embarrassing. I tried so hard. I don't think you guys understand. Like my whole life, I think I've always wanted to be a YouTuber, but like 
I would film it, edit it, and then I'd put it up, and then I'd be like, what if someone from school finds this? So I would delete yeah. it so fast. That's why it's like amazing how much courage you have. Thank you. I mean, there were like haters. haters. Yeah, there were definitely some very mean people. No, but like, look where you are now. You forget every time I'm sorry. Home. I'm sorry, guys. Okay, she just put so out more Mercier. Right? No. It was oh, okay. NYC. I I'm really cheap. It looked just like Laura Mercier. I thought I saw a brown, brown cap. Oh. But I'm going to go for my derma blend translucent powder. Mm, you look beautiful. I'm going for that Morphe 350 powder. I'm going to use that. We were talking about how, you know, when you film a video, you don't realize like that something's like messed up mm -hmm. until like after you're like editing it. Yeah. So when I was in high school, mm -hmm. I was a senior in high school, I filmed a makeup routine or something like that. Mm -hmm. And I was not even using a mirror. I was using the viewfinder to do my makeup. Honestly, I used to do that all the time. Like I just started like maybe this past yeah. year. Is that weird? Actually that is because you're like hardcore YouTuber and like you've been doing this for so long. Yeah, it's true. But like I was like, <laughs> so I went the whole time looking at the viewfinder to do my makeup. Uh -huh. And it, since it's so far away and like so small, mm. it looks amazing. Yeah. So oh God. After, <laughs> after I did my video, uh -huh. I looked back and I did not blend. And it happens to me like almost every <laughs> video, like, like my eyebrows are really messed up or like, I don't know. Do you just post the video or do you yes. just restart? <laughs> no, I'm not going to restart for that reason. <laughs> I'm using the Laura Mercier Candle Glow Sheer Perfecting Powder. I love this for like a nose highlight because it's very subtle. And it honestly like contours my nose for me, which yeah. is like nice. It's like nice and bronzy. Yeah. I really like it. Apologies if anything's out of focus. I, you know, don't have my Instagram husband in the back of the camera right now. <laughs> we should get Antonio to do it. When you're doing your makeup, like when you're like by yourself, mm -hmm. do you sing? A lot? No. What the hell? You don't like so quiet. <laughs> I'm always in my bathroom. watching YouTube videos. Oh, that's so true. I forgot. I'm gonna go get some stuff. Okay. Are you almost done already? No. Good. <laughs> I might win this. Damn it! I know! You probably are! No, I'm still on my eyes. Oh, that's true. <laughs> but I haven't gotten my eyes yet, so... Does your eyes take a long time? Mm, yeah, because blending. I'm using the Milani Soleil Baked Bronzer. I'm gonna contour with this. It's a really nice subtle bronzer. I wish that like Morphe 350 had like color names because then we could like tell you guys. Oh, that's so true. <laughs> well, like, it doesn't. Okay, I'm looking less like a potato, which is exciting. Can you see? Oh, girl! You are not a potato anymore! You know. <laughs> now I'm gonna go in with a darker um contour color this is the makeup forever eyeshadow in pink brown now i'm gonna go with my foundation this is the wet and wild photo focus foundation in the color toffee that's how i like my coffee Ooh, toffee i don't get it i don't either okay <laughs> i actually really like this stuff just because it has an applicator but smell it smells like paint it, oh my god it literally smells like you just painted a room that literally smells like poisonous yeah i know like you should be putting it on your face but it like works so well like, yeah i bet i love it and it's so cheap it's only like 5.99 at cvs oh, geez, that is really cheap. So, i feel like whenever people say cheap now it's like 12 dollars like, yeah drugstore is like moving up on the prices and i'm just like can we just stay where we were? We we were good where I we know. were. <laughs> like, like when I saw your Snapchat of the Elf thing, and I was like, that's so true. Elf used to be so. It cheap. used to be like all a dollar or ninety nine yeah. cents. Like yeah. I used to make like purchases on purchases on purchases mm -hmm. like on the website because it was so exactly freaking cheap. <sighs> I gotta do that to us, Elf. They're coming out with higher um, quality products, so like I get it. But it just sucks because like we're all so used to it, you know. Yeah. What I mean? Like when you're starting out super cheap, like it's just so hard to like, you know, come up from that. But I'm using the next um, micro brow pencil <laughs> for my eyebrows. I like the more natural look, but sometimes I'm just so used to doing it with dip brow that I do it with dip brow. If that makes sense, like. It's faster for me because it's not just like little tiny strokes with the micro brow pencil. 
So let's talk about spring break plans. What are you gonna do? Oh my gosh, don't even get me started. I don't even know. I want to do something like fun, but mm -hmm. like I'm just not fun. You should go to like springs and stuff. Do you guys have that in Jacksonville? No, there's a lot in Gainesville though. Is that close though? Um, I feel like it's two hours away from Jacksonville. It's not. That's not bad. Yeah, we can do like a road trip there. I am having two weeks of spring break because I just, you know, lucky girl. Date myself <laughs> <laughs> two weeks. You know, called off work, just kidding, I don't have a job. So this coming week, I'm leaving for Destin, Florida, um, and I'm gonna stay with Ryan's family. I'm so excited, because first of all, I get to see my boyfriend, mm -hmm. and second of all, I get to be in my favorite place ever. Um, I love, love, love Destin. I used to go there every year for spring break in high school. It's not a second home, but it's definitely like a place with a lot of memories um, because me and Ryan, you know, that's where I started like liking him, which is weird, I don't know. That Maybe we'll weird. tell that story on my blog because that would be funny to hear mm -hmm. from him because he has a whole other side. <laughs> But, and there's such good food at NC State. Like every time I go to Cocoa Beach, like I'm expecting like such good seafood and mm -hmm. stuff, but like it always disappoints. Like and last time I went, I got hot dogs, and I was like happier to get that than like some seafood that costs like 20 bucks that like I didn't even like, you know? Mm -hmm. I'm probably gonna like take this right off when I'm done. Why? Cause I don't think I'm doing anything today. <laughs> what the hell? Just keep it on. Just take some selfies. What the hell? Okay, so I'm gonna take some of my Makeup Geek eyeshadows and play with those today. Um, let's start with Creme Brulee. Oh, you hit Pam on that. No, don't remind me. That's good though. I feel like I never hit Pam on any of my eyeshadows because I don't use them enough. Yeah. But I feel like Creme Brulee is such a nice color. Like, mm -hmm. Very, like, it's probably like the first one I ever used. No, honestly, I wish there were more YouTubers that were like, literally our skin color. Yeah. Like, they're either A, like really, like, they're ethnic, but they're light, mm, true, or true. they're really, really dark. And yeah. It's just like, I can't like relate to you. <laughs> yeah. Back to talking about spring break though. Um, my second week of spring break, I'm coming back to Orlando. So like, I have to drive up to Destin then come back down to Orlando. Then I'm not driving, but like me and my friends are driving to Helen, Georgia. And that'll be fun because we're getting like a cabin, which is cool. You're saying we're gonna hike a lot and I don't know if I'm ready for that really. So, you know, catch me in the hot tub. So I know we have a lot of um, UCF viewers. So why did you choose UCF? <laughs> I love this story. <laughs> So my junior year uh -huh. for spring break, I was like, wow, Laura, college is coming up. You might as well tour some schools. No, I did a senior year. Oh, really? Yeah, I think I did a senior year. Yeah, I did my junior year. Uh -huh. So I like um, signed up for so many different like colleges they like like in Florida. Yeah. So I did UF, FSU, and UCF. And UCF mm -hmm. was the first one. Mm -hmm. So I think since I was so excited to like tour colleges, mm -hmm. like when I saw UCF, I was like, <gasps> Yeah. Oh my god. And I was like so happy because like it was so diverse. Like yeah. everyone, you know, was like a different ethnicity. Like yeah. there wasn't like a click really. Yeah. And like it was just so modern and like Oh my god. Literally, I, I, I say that all the time. I was so in love. And like when yeah. I saw like, you know, um the dorms, I was like, oh my god, it looks like apartments. It like looks like a resort. I think that's like a really common like thing to say, like mm -hmm. like you were so in love, like right when you got to the tour. Like, I think it's so important. Exactly. Like, I really recommend if you go to any school, do a tour, but like UCF is really love at first sight. Like you you gotta see it. Like, I don't think like pictures do it justice. I don't think no, like, anything I online do, does it justice. Yeah. Like, cause I saw, for your own eyes. I saw pictures like from brochures. And yeah, me and I too. Like, I was like, okay. Yeah. Yeah, yeah literally. Like, <laughs> but the pit, like in real life, it's just like so, it's like it's own little town. Yeah. Like, and it's so cute. Yeah. And so after I toured UCF, mm -hmm. I was like, I want to come here. Yeah. I toured FSU, didn't want to do it, so I canceled my UF yeah, tour because I didn't even want just way to go. <laughs> yeah. I'm taking Grand Stand, my favorite favorite shimmery eyeshadow. Ugh. My favorite shimmery eyeshadow ever for Makeup Geek. Curling my eyelashes is like the hardest thing ever. I used to. Oh my god, we're doing it so time. But my whole life, I've always used waterproof mascara. I used to, yeah. But I used to sleep with my mascara on until I like showered and took it off. 
Are you insane? Yeah. Like, <gasps> we should, I should do like a video of all the weird things you used to do. Yeah, like with makeup. Because like, I did everything wrong. Oh my gosh, that's so funny. Like, I don't even know how that happened and how I even still have eyelashes to this day. No, seriously though. No. <laughs> don't know. <laughs> When I was in seventh grade, mm -hmm. that's when I like didn't wear waterproof mascara. Uh -huh. And I would like, it would get really clumpy and I would just sit there in class and like take the clumps off. Oh, it was so fun. Did eyelashes come out of it? Well, sometimes actually. Oh my God, that's so bad. I love putting mascara on because I feel like I don't look dead anymore. Yeah. In middle school, mm -hmm. you know, you get like picked on, especially because, well, at least I'm hairy. I'm yeah, really hairy. I'm hairy too. And like I would have like a unibrow or just like really bushy eyebrows. I started like, hair removal so young, like so. Oh, young. oh my gosh! My mom didn't even let me shave my legs in seventh grade, and they oh, were <laughs> it was so embarrassing. I was like very insecure. Like I would literally, I think I've said this a lot, but I would literally wear like long sleeves on the playground mm -hmm. in the summer because people would say I was like hairy, and like I don't know, people like just did not have a filter. Like even I when know. I was a kid, I would never say anything like no, that. No, same. I'm like, who raised you? Yeah, I'm like, how can you just say that? I'm like so thankful that we like lived in a generation where being ugly in middle school was a thing. Yeah, yeah. Like, nowadays, middle schoolers are so pretty and I'm like, you're not gonna be able to glow up. Like, That's so true. we look back on our picture like, wow, uh, we did a good job. Yeah. So yeah, I'm gonna make sure my child is really ugly <laughs> in middle school. <laughs> I'm not gonna give them any like acne face. <laughs> Look at me now. Look at me now. Are you done? Almost. D wait! <laughs> wait! I don't even have my lipstick with me! <laughs> okay. That's not fair. Go so, get it. Okay. Go get it. We'll finish at the same time. Okay. Then I'm gonna go in with my Naked Illuminated. Like, this is a very like bronzy, like summery color. Yeah. So I like it a lot. I'm using the MUA Makeup Academy in the color Fig. This is really nice quality and it's very invigorating too. Ooh! Yeah. That word! I know. I went to college. So now I know it's for work size. Yeah. And you can only get this at CVS. Ooh. I think. Actually, now that I look at it, it's a more of a berry color. Like a dark, like, purple. Mmm. Okay, now I'm taking my exposed gloss from Kylie Cosmetics and putting that over. Sonali's like known for like mixing up all her colors. Yeah. Like, oh, what color is that? And she's like, can't tell you because there's like three different, you know, like, like 500. <laughs> or like, what mascara are you wearing? Oh, it's like 500 <laughs> different tubes. Are we done? Did we glow yeah. up? Yeah, I think I beat you too. You're mean, but it wasn't by law. I honestly yeah. thought it was gonna be like an hour after you. <laughs> so that was very surprising. Hey guys, so today we're gonna do a day to nighttime look. Day night. <laughs> ooh, ooh. <laughs> well, choose to call me on my cell phone. Beep, beep, beep. Love you now. What? <laughs> oh, wait. <laughs> tee, tee, tee. I'm gonna do my hair and come back and then we'll do our little glow up little ooh. thing. So this is our glow up. We hope you guys enjoyed our video and let me know in the comments what you thought about it if you want me to do more videos with Laura. <laughs> Send us some love and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys!